so day number one of this road trip to phoenix arizona or just arizona in general is underway um the plan was to hit the road at 4 a.m which i kind of already knew wasn't gonna happen um it's 4 41 right now so i'm still within the four o'clock window i'm about to get out and hit this road debating on if i want to stop at starbucks or just kind of figure out what i'm gonna get to eat or whatever on the way but i'll check in with y'all a little bit later of course on a long ride you gotta have good music so the ride from la to arizona was actually pretty smooth I definitely wish that there was a lot more things to look at on the way up. Everything's pretty flat and, you know, it wasn't really too much flattering to look at. But, I mean, all in all, it was a pretty smooth ride. So, I have finally arrived in Arizona. I'm in Glendale, Arizona to be exact. One thing about me is I like shoes. I stopped here at the Tanger Outlets for the Nike Outlet. Um, I got here a little bit too early. They don't open until 11. I actually thought they opened at 10. I probably should have checked that. I was a little bit too anxious. So I figured that I'd check in, let y'all know that I made it. Still waiting on the homies to get here. One flying in, a few driving, and then one of them is already here. I just haven't hit them up yet. I want to, you know, kind of explore around a little bit on my own and then, you know, link up with him, link up with everybody else when they get here. But yeah, man, first time in Arizona. I can't wait to see what happens. After picking YC up from the airport, me and him got something to eat and we linked up at the homie Angel's house while we waited for Creative Ryan, Alex, and Kid Nick to get in from their portion of the road trip. After that, we linked up at this airport, abandoned airport, planes, graffiti, it was crazy. My camera shit is... You gotta run and grab oh it. Oh my gosh. Your what? camera's over there. It's right there to the right. I thought we had 10 minutes, but... What do we gotta do? Do I gotta like hide my eyes? Uh, yeah. Squint. Yo. Okay, Nick's in the car. Yeah, Nick's in the car. Nick's in the car. Yo, we got a crazy dust storm right now. So we were having a dope time. We were getting all sorts of crazy footage, like six different cameras going all at the same time, drones, GoPros, all sorts of stuff going on. And we all got this notice on our phone that a dust storm is gonna come in at a certain point. It's gonna last for so long, so on and so forth. I think Angel was the only one that didn't get it. And we all got it. We all just pretty much swiped that notification out of the way. We didn't pay no attention. Um, next thing you know, we end up getting caught in that dust storm that we just got informed about. 
it was pretty crazy to say the least and the footage that you just saw about or with the dust storm that was actually angel angels footage he kept recording he kept the camera rolling while everything was going on so big shout out to angel for keeping that um camera rolling so then we can have the footage and actually kind of give people an insight on what was going on especially since we were actually caught in it we were in the middle of nowhere you can't see anything the visibility was zero slim to none i'll say and it was just a crazy experience so for day one to go like that we all link up we link at this spot we get this dope footage not to mention that it was crazy hot it was 120 degrees so record-breaking day in terms of the temperature then on top of that we end up getting caught in a in a dust storm so day one was definitely one for the books it was crazy vibes crazy content crazy temperatures crazy dust storms crazy everything it was pretty dope if you want to see day two and three make sure y'all subscribe to the channel hit that bell notification so then y'all can stay notified for when i drop it and any other content that i'm dropping after this i'll catch y'all in the next video man y'all stay creative peace